It's so sad. We report far too many stories of children getting their hands on firearms, and it often ends in tragedy. Well, two men in our community want to make sure parents know how to protect their children while still protecting their home, and they're doing it with a new book. Joining us is co-owner of Erica's Big Day, Kevin Jordan. Kevin, good morning to you. Good morning. I got to tell you, I absolutely love this idea because we have seen this happen far too many times, especially recently. And we keep telling parents to lock up the guns, to get a gun lock. But this helps explain it to the children just how dangerous it is. Yes, it does. And that was kind of the idea because, you know, when you as a responsible armed citizen, you go to class, you get taught, you know, the, the gun safety laws, the gun safety rules. but. I was like, well, let's create a book that can teach the kids the same, you know, rules, but in a different way. Because I feel like, you know, most parents go home with a firearm, there's going to be kids there. So the kids need to understand some rules, too, and some responsibilities to, you know, to teach the kids some things. Yeah, and a lot of times when kids uh, come across a firearm, the only thing they've ever seen is something on TV or in a movie, and it doesn't translate to real life. How are you able to translate in this book um, and teach kids to stay away? Throughout the book, um, it's a theme. Um, the theme is stop, don't touch, run, go tell an adult. And the book is throughout the whole book. So that's kind of like one of the things we try to teach the kids to st stop, don't touch, run, go tell them the dog. So they just pick up on that. And, you know, because you have, you know, YouTube, you, the kids play video games and they see things on, you know, on social media, they think that's the proper way they're supposed to handle or, you know, or do, be with a gun or a firearm. And that's not true. What so we just try to put that in the book. When was the moment you decided to do this? And, and why did you decide to do it through a book? Do you, do you have experience with books in the past or just something you thought would be a good no, idea? No, so really, you know, I'm always, I'm always have ideas. Yeah. Um, I'm the kid that played hide go seek in granddad's house. And I was the guy, you know, running through alleys and always seeing things you weren't supposed to see. Mm -hmm. So I was a curious little boy. and. As me, you know, playing high go seeking in the house, I will come across, oh, that's a shotgun. Oh, that's my grandfather's handgun. Oh, you know, let me touch it. Because, you know, boys are curious. So I felt like, okay, we teaching adults firearm safety. We also need to teach kids firearm safety. Because we train a kid, we save a kid. And that's kind of like the motto. And previously, you know, before, it wasn't that many um uh, kids getting shot by uh, unsecured firearms, but now yeah. with the increase of firearms in the homes, now you see more and more of that happening. And I think we really need to teach responsibility to the parents, like, you know, at, at a higher level, and also to have that trickle down to the kids, because mm -hmm. if the firearms in the house with the parents, the kids are in the house, so they see it. So you need to have a conversation with your kid about firearm safety. In the book, it's kind of like an icebreaker, because most parents are kind of, you know, a little scared, or yeah. oh, I don't want to teach my son or daughter about the firearm, because they're uncomfortable with it, too. And I feel that, you know, the more the parents are comfortable with the firearm or you know education of it that would trickle down to the kids absolutely then, i remember i have a similar experience you know my grandparents they'd have one in the attic and when we were out playing and and we'd see it you were kind of scared to ask about it so this you know broaches that subject before it even comes up yeah and, and you know uh because if you look at, you know, book and the flyer, it's cute. You know, it's colorful. You know, kids may ask, well, who is Erica? What is stop, don't touch, run, tell them the dog. The moment that happens, now you can engage with your, your son or daughter. Who now is you Erica, got that by the way? Icebreaker. Erica is Erica Safely. It's just some kid we created. Uh-huh. I wasn't just, sure if you, you know, had out it. Of, uh, an Erica Bella. yourself. <laughs> no, I didn't have an Erica. I got a Bella, Bella Booyah. And she's, <laughs> I got a Bella Booyah. I don't have an Erica. But some, everybody has an Erica. Everybody knows a kid. And throughout what Erica does is throughout the day, she teaches her friends how to navigate around firearms. So you read the book. A scenario is they were at the park. Um, and they they come across a firearm. Mm -hmm. And she tell them, stop, don't touch, run and tell them the dog. Because in the yeah. book, her father taught her that some gun safety, you know, rules. So she was able to teach her friends to how to, you know, navigate around firearms. 
Well, I absolutely, Kev, and I love this idea. Where can we order the book right now if we want to? The book is online at www.ericasbigday.com. Um, you can also go on, follow me at on IG at Heavy Metal Lifestyle 223. Go to my bio, um, link tree, and you can go to Erica's Big Day. You can, you know, go in there and purchase a book. Um, a lot of books are going pre, pre-order because we kind of sold out. Hmm. And like I said, just follow Erica's Big Day. Follow me at Heavy Metal Lifestyle 223 because we're trying to implement the, the program because even with the book, it's a lot of, um, it's, we have education at the end. So we, we develop, we are developing curriculum, mm-hmm. you know, to go out in these community organizations like uh, New Era uh, Detroit, yeah. you know, we're going to do, be doing some things with them. Um, and I'm trying to get it like in boys and girls clubs and the YMCA's just yeah. like just little, a little soft, you know, little introduction sure. to some safety. Um, you know, gun safety uh, curriculum. Well, it's absolutely a great idea. I did see some of the the videos on Instagram. So kudos to you for helping to uh, keep our children safe. We're going to put all that information on our website, fox2detroit.com. Kevin, thank you. And I want to thank you for having me, Amy.